This is the Autel Maxi Scope MP408, which I currently have it connected to the Autel uh, scan tool, the MS906TS. Both of these units I purchased off of Amazon. Um, however, each unit they were through uh, separate sellers. I didn't purchase them at the same time. Uh, one tip: be aware if you're looking to buy a scan tool. Um, I found out when it was too late after the fact for me to return it to Amazon uh, that if I have any problems uh, and I need to warranty out this scan tool I'll have to ship it overseas and I have to deal directly with China so you can find an authorized US dealer which they have a company I believe out in New York and you'll be able to deal with them instead so there is a group on Facebook a dedicated auto group on Facebook and you can find authorized sellers through there or you could contact Autel and there's other uh, resources online as well. Um, as for the scope, when I purchased that from Amazon, uh, this was the box that it, that it came in. However, when I received it, it was exactly as is. So it was never sealed. The shipping label was, you know, slapped right on top of the box and anybody had access uh, to open the scope at any point in time. So thankfully no components were missing. Um, so that was a huge con uh, when I purchased the scope through Amazon. So I'm not sure if that was something with the seller, but uh, regardless, I didn't like that. So here is the scope itself when you receive it. Um, this is it, four channels. I currently have the uh, small alligator clips hooked up to it. This, this is uh, one of the test leads that's included with the kit. And this is just connected to a 12 volt battery. Um, it also includes the USB cord. So you can connect this uh, directly to your scan tool. And I have a video. Um, there is a another downfall when you purchase the scope you do have to update the firmware however if you're using the scope primarily with the scan tool as long as you have an active subscription you can update the firmware it has to be connected but you can update the firmware with an active subscription uh, directly onto the scan tool uh, using their app However, if your subscription expires, as mine did, uh, you will have to connect this directly up to a PC and go on Autel's website and download the scope software onto your website, and then you could update that scope onto the PC that way. Um, I do have a separate video already uploaded onto the channel. Uh, I'll put a link in the description for that. As for what's included in the kit, you do receive um, a set of multimeter probes and these tips, you can actually, they have a four millimeter adapter um, that you can connect to, let's say, an alligator clip or what, whatnot. You also receive two 20 to 1 attenuators. You receive a back probe uh, pin set. So it comes with five actual back probes that are four millimeter as well, and then a bunch of little back probe just pins. You also receive two large alligator clips. So then your kit should also include a secondary ignition pickup uh, cable. Um, should come. in a bag with a little information tab like that and that's also a hand tech brand as well another addition you could pick up for this scope uh, this accessory would be great for coil on plugs so you could pick up that probe on Amazon as well the kit should also include a two pin breakout test lead the kit should also include four of these uh, 10 foot test leads um, 
This purple thing is just a magnetic key holder that I bought off of Amazon. They have a set, but it's actually I have it color coded to each uh, channel on the scope. Uh, reason I have this on there is uh, if it's in the way of any belts or anything, I just kind of pop it up onto the hood or something, to get it out of the way. So when it comes to the accessories for the scope, um, you have your banana leads here, and they're four millimeter. So the problem is uh, you have male and female ends. So I had to buy an adapter, so that's a BNC adapter, and basically I unscrew that. And for my amp clamp, um, I purchased this from Amazon as well, as you can see. They won't connect. So I bought this adapter for I think six or eight dollars and I connect that directly to the scope. Just like so. And then you have a ground positive. This adapter actually has the ground uh, indicator right there for you. But uh, so there are some adapters out there that you may want to pick up with the scope as well. Um, if you're interested in more testing and more videos regarding uh, oscilloscope, uh, make sure to subscribe to the channel.